What is up everybody welcome to another video today I'm gonna show you how to mod Skyrim on the PS4 it's actually really easy but if you don't know I'm gonna teach you that right now also I'm gonna be doing some more Skyrim videos of just me playing and having fun and I'm gonna be posting that later on throughout the week so make sure you smash the like button and subscribe but let's jump right into the tutorial first thing you do is hit mods on the main menu of Skyrim it's gonna ask you to sign in with your Bethesda account if you do not have one, I will be posting in the description the website where you can create one. But essentially is you go to Bethesda.net and then you hit join now on the top right corner. It's gonna ask you to create an account, you're gonna do so. And then it's gonna ask you to verify your account, you know, by sending you an email and all of that. Once you have completed all of those things, then you go back to the game uh, on your console and log in with the account that you just created. And honestly, that's pretty much it. Once you are in you will see a lot of mods there's not that many right now but there will be more added later on i'm not sure if xbox one and ps4 have the same exact mods i'm not quite sure on that but as you guys can see there's a couple mods right here that you guys can apply to your game there's like this one for example which allows you to see your player get wet when you go in the water or when it's raining there's all the minor things like your you know new clothes or allows you to carry more stuff there's also sheets that you can add to the game new animation for spells and your stuff that allows you to disable the cinematic kills and my favorite ones of all the ones that allow you to improve the game graphics not necessarily the graphics but the way that the game looks by giving it just a slight tweak that makes it look even more beautiful than it already is in the remastered version but anyways once you have selected the mod that you want to download you simply just hit it and hit download but if you want to save it for later on use or if you just want to have it somewhere where you can find it quickly you can just set it as your favorite i recommend doing this because it makes it a lot easier to find mods as of right now there's not that many mods so it's not too hard to find specific ones but later on they're gonna be adding a lot a lot more and it's gonna get even harder another quick tip if you scroll down uh, you can see the mods by category for example you can see mods for animals armor buildings characters all kinds of stuff so it makes it easier for you to find again more specific mods that you're looking for but that's it guys it was just a quick mod to show you how to install uh, mods on your console you know the, the, the bigger the mod the longer it's gonna take to install but it really doesn't take that long for the most part and as always remember that once you back out it's gonna reload your game because obviously you added new mods it's just gonna take about one or two seconds and then boom you have your mods and you're able to play and have fun with these amazing creations another quick thing that i want to mention though is you do not get trophies for playing with mods so to make sure that if you're collecting trophies you do not put any mods in your game but that's it guys thanks for watching make sure you hit that like button and subscribe if you found this helpful and i'll catch you guys in the next video